Independent Healers, Gopal by 100 Pipers Music CDs and Housing.com. We all know that India is rising with population and arable land is going down. There's a huge pressure on farmers to meet the demand of food for the growing population. Farmers are left with no options than using huge amounts of fertilizers and pesticides, which is causing contamination in the food, which leading to several diseases in human beings these days. So moving forward down the line, two to three years, the temperatures are going to shoot up. The soil is not going to be of any use because of the excessive use of fertilizers and pesticides, uh, which is degrading the soil. And the water level is getting decreased. What if I told you there's a way to plant your own vegetables in your own home with no soil and very little water? Urban Kisan a Hyderabad-based startup has come up with a solution that's an alternative to conventional farming. And the solution is called hydroponics, or soilless farming. So I started this when I was about 23. I've uh, put in almost about four and a half years of my life into uh, becoming a CA. After that, there were two roads in front of me. One is the CA life, where I become a chartered accountant. And the other road was taking me towards building something greater, something bigger than myself. I started my research on hydroponics in the year 2017. So my primary focus has been, uh, you know, the developing this hydroponics technology for Indian green. I was just uh, searching everywhere as to how the US is doing, how the Europe is doing. And then uh, I incidentally met Dr. Sairam uh, in his house where he was doing this experiment. I uh, took him into uh, my balcony and then showed him what actually I'm doing already. The moment I saw the hydroponic kit, uh, which he has built it for himself, that was the moment I knew that this is it. He was so excited and he came out with the idea, of, why don't we work together? Our objective uh, was to bring food as close as possible to people and make it more transparent. And we didn't want to go with traditional agricultural methods. So we started our research on hydroponics. For us to form a company, it took about more than a year. Uh, the reason is there hasn't been any research papers on hydroponics for Indian crops, for Indian climatic conditions. Hydroponics, to put it in a simple language, is basically soilless farming. We use no pesticides, no harmful chemicals to grow vegetables or fruits. We basically uh, use 95% less water than traditional soil farming. The initial process is very similar to traditional farming, wherein uh, instead of uh, sowing the seed in the soil, we sow it in coconut waste. And then uh, we put them in the seeding trays. It stays about 20 days and then you uh, you'll see this root growth which is happening here and from here it needs larger systems to grow so it is transplanted into uh, something called as net pots and once we place them in the net pots it directly goes inside these NFT channels these NFT channels are, are basically food grade pipes in which water flows uh, continuously nutrient filled water and then for the rest of the cycle it retains here uh, for about 20 more days. So the only two things which someone has to monitor regularly uh, in a hydroponic system is how much nutrients are available in the water, which is TDS, total dissolved salts, and how much of pH is there uh, in the uh, water. See, the challenge is uh, each crop requires a different set of nutrients with the different concentrations, combinations to get the best performance out of it. You will be able to see over a period, it grows as big as these, uh, which are almost ready for harvest. Uh, in the last five months, we've sold more than 150 home kits, wherein 150 people are daily harvesting their own food. We have planted palak, methi, 
कोथमीर उगाया है केल है डेली घर के यूज के लिए तो हम लोग अभी ग्रीन ही खाने लगे हैं इतना निकलता है This um, basically is a very big advantage in hydroponics because we can create small farms inside cities. Probably 10-15 farms of hydroponics could feed the entire city's growing needs uh, as well. Any plant can be grown in hydroponics, but what matters is whether they are economically sustainable or not. So currently, we are focusing on those, and our research is not going to limit. We are sure that one day we will grow. any crop in hydroponics on one side uh, the population is increasing and one side the resources are decreasing and the other side people are not willing to farm so this gap has to be bridged otherwise we might end up in a scenario where there's uh, people end up starving i'm sairam chief scientist urban kisan my vision is to see the agriculture sustainable with less utilization of resources I am Vihari Kanakollu CEO of Urban Kisan I want to ensure that every household has access to fresh and safe food